You know, ever since this game came out and I familiarized myself with these toys, I've always wondered if you can build a full 360 degree loop. So I'm wondering if I could just place a small vehicle down right here and then sit on it. Can I just ride the loop all the way up and over and then come out on the other side completely unscathed without ever leaving the surface and falling upside down halfway up the loop. So I've been messing around here a little bit, testing this theory out, made myself a little car here. And well, as you can see, it went up the loop, but it somehow ended up over here. And I want to first off try and get so that the car can get up at least halfway up this hill before we continue in making a loop. Because if we can't even get up this part halfway and get that dynamic foundation hit off there with the car, we're not going to be able to finish the rest of the loop. So first off, we have to build a little car just like that. And obviously, it's going to be a pain trying to get that back up here. So we're going to just rebuild one real quick. And it's not too hard. And there we go. I'm going to try this out again. Not going to sit on it so we can see exactly where it goes. And we'll be able to see what we need to do exactly to get this thing to make a loop. Nope. Spoke too soon. Our switch fell off. There we go. So let's test this out and see if we can't knock that dynamic foundation off up there. So just as I thought. The second it leaves. Oh, it's still going over there. Look at it. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, it's done. So the second I leave this fence here, it decides to take its own path off wherever it wants to go. So I think we're going to have to figure out a way to place some fences on these things. So that way the car doesn't just get its mind of its own and go wherever it wants to go. So I'm going to figure out how to do this real quick. Uh, I might have to use some of these white railings as well. So it's not going to look pretty, but guess what? It's going to work. Trust me, guys. Okay, so I got a railing. Oh, there's a mysterious button right here. Oh, well, hopefully that doesn't mess with anything it doesn't let me break it oh well guys so hopefully this works a little bit better oh my goodness hopefully we can get up here and try to knock that dynamic foundation down but let's test it out again let's build that car again and see let's see if we can't get up there and make at least a half loop because like i said if we can't even do that there's no point in trying to do a full loop all right guys we got our car here again hopefully that button in the middle there doesn't mess it up i don't know how to get rid of this I'm hoping it doesn't mess up the car. We might have to leave the game and come back. But just for now, let's test this out and see how this works. Oh, yeah, it worked. Oh, no. That didn't work. It went... Where did it go? It went, like, halfway up. And then it kind of turned up here. I don't know how far it made it up or where it decided to turn. Um, yeah, I don't know. We might have to come up with a different design. Let's try that one more time and see if we can't get it down this time. All right, guys, I got the same car here again. And I think I know what the issue is. It's not reaching all the way out to the end of these fences here so we might that might be our issue here but let's try this one more time and see exactly where it does decide to turn off at okay so it actually worked that time but obviously the second it got away from the fences it took off and did its own thing again so i think we need to come up with a different design we will be right back and we'll see if we can't come up with a different design all right, guys, and before it gets nighttime out, I got a new design here. It's a little bit tighter in the fences here. I'm going to see if that works so it doesn't uh, hit the, so it doesn't turn this time in the fence. But uh, we're going to test this out, and then we're going to wait till daytime and see what else we can do. Oh, my goodness, guys, it worked. Oh, it almost come back and hit us. All right, guys, I think we have found the design. That actually worked really well. It went up there, it hit the dynamic foundation. Obviously, I think it's going to need more power, so we're going to have to place a large thruster, if not two. But guys, that went right up, straight up. I think this might work. Let's wait till the morning here and test this out again. All right, guys, it's now the morning time out, and I have extended the loop a little bit, as you can see. And I think I have found a way so that we can keep the car in the track at all times. I'm not 100% sure if this is going to work, but it's the only way I could think of building like sideways because obviously you can't build these railings sideways going up this thing. So I had to brainstorm a little bit and hopefully that works. Let's get over here and build ourselves a car and see how far, if not, we can make it to the top of that loop there. All right, guys, and here we go. The moment of truth. Let's see what this thing can do. Oh my goodness, guys, it did it! Oh, dude, <laughs> that is awesome. I actually never thought that would actually work. Oh my goodness, guys, 
I honestly think this is going to work. If we just finish this loop all the way around, it could honestly just keep going in a circle as long as the thruster's pushed. I mean, obviously, once we come back down here, it's gonna reach up back with its track, but I'm gonna leave a little tiny gap, so that way, when we first start off, we can still go under here. And then after that, we can just keep going around in circles over and over. And, uh, yeah. I, I am, I am impressed, man. I did not think that was gonna work. Let's finish building this thing and test it out because I am too excited. I gotta, I gotta keep building this thing. But anyways, if you guys can't see how I'm building this and you want to build in your own world, basically, I'm just taking these rustic thin floor pieces, the 16 by 2, and I'm stacking them up trying to make as much of a circle as I can. Obviously, it's impossible to make circles in this game, so I'm trying to mimic it as much as I can. And honestly, you don't need to do this dynamic foundation down here. I just thought it looked really cool. But I'm gonna keep spamming these around till I get a circle like this, and then we're gonna have to put a bunch of the guardrail around, which is gonna take forever, so I'm not gonna have you guys sit around and watch me do that. So I'm gonna do that real quick, and I'll meet back with you guys here once I'm done. All right, guys. Oh, I messed up that piece right there. But anyways, all right, guys. That took oh, a wee bit longer than I uh, would have hoped it took. But oh my goodness, guys. Look at this beautiful thing. It is complete. And if you can see, I kind of switched using those flooring pieces out for the wood foundation. It saved a lot of time than spamming a bajillion of those floor pieces. And definitely, if you're doing this in survival, it's going to save you... A ton of materials and of course the second I start talking it gets nighttime out and I don't want to test this out in the nighttime so I will be back with you guys when it is daytime and now that it is daytime out guys Wow just look at this thing this thing is absolutely amazing so this thing has taken me a while to come up with not only with this idea but it's taking me a while to build this thing like there's a lot of pieces in this thing so the least you guys could do for me is smash that like button. And if you want to see more amazing content like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn post notifications on so you never miss another video. Anyways, let's test this thing out and see how this thing does. Alrighty guys, I got my car all set up right here. Uh, don't mind that. That was just a failed attempt at getting a cinematic uh, look at this thing. <laughs> Hopefully we can fit under here with that car. I don't see why it couldn't. I don't know about once we put a seat on here, but we'll cross that bridge later when the time comes. I am really excited to see if this thing does a full loop. Like, I hope it doesn't get stuck in one of these crevices here, because that would suck. I put so much time and effort into building this thing. This recording has been going on for quite a while now. But I only have two small thrusters here, so hopefully that's enough power to get it through this loop. But that's enough yapping. Without further ado, three, two, one! Let's go! Oh my goodness, guys. No! No! It fell off! No! I think it fell off, like, right here. Yeah, it's not very thick right here. Hell no, man. What the fuck, man? Guys, that's not what I meant. I meant to say it's not very... You know what I meant, guys. All right, let's try that again. Hopefully this time it'll work. All right, guys. Take number two. This time we got a large thruster here. Hopefully this works. It looks like it's already starting to bind on the fence because I accidentally just pressed the button. But anyways, without further ado, take number two with the large thruster in three, two, one. Oops, voice crack. One. Oops, voice crack. One. Let's go. Oh my goodness, guys, that was worse than the first time. Maybe the small thrusters was the, was the original idea. Let's break this and try the small thrusters again. I am not stopping until we get this. All right, guys. Take number 376. We're doing the double thrusters again. Now I'm just playing, guys. This is take number three with the double thrusters. Let's see what happens. No, dude. It's stuck there. What is it doing? All right, guys. Take number four. Three, two, one. Let's go. No, dude, it keeps getting stuck there. All right, guys, we got two cars right here, and we are going to examine this to make sure we can see exactly where it keeps going. If not, it should work this time. Let's see what happens with this first car. Oh, my goodness. No, <laughs> that's the farthest one yet. Oh, my goodness. 
So I made it past the first hump there. Oh no, that's not good. We don't need the cars falling and breaking everything. Okay, so that one made it a little bit farther. We gotta see why it didn't make it. So it, it turned like right here. So I'm honestly thinking, I don't know. Maybe this piece, but no, that wouldn't make sense. It'd make dollars. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. That was cringe. You guys can click off the video now if you want. Anyways, I don't know. I think it's just trial and error now. I mean, obviously it's not going to work every time. So maybe this time it'll work. Let's try this car out and see what happens. Oh, no. Oh, dude. It was like halfway there. It got to right here. Guys, I'm thinking I might need more power. I feel like I need more power. It doesn't seem to have enough power to make it. And it's also starting to like turn itself. Let's just add, they were doing two thrusters before guys. Let's add four thrusters and see what happens. Four small thrusters. All right guys, take number. I have no idea. Please work this time. Ready guys? Boom. Oh, that's a lot of power. That's too much power. Okay, we figured it out. You can have too much power. I wonder if it's not working because I need a longer wheelbase. What if I need to have a longer car? Oh my gosh, guys, I think I might have cracked the code. This whole time, I just needed a longer car. Let's make a longer car and see what happens. Okay, guys, I got my longer car here. The wheels are spread out a lot wider this time. Let's hope this one works because I don't know what to do after this if this doesn't work. Ready, guys? Let's go! Oh, come on. Come on, this is working good. Oh! Guys, I think that would have worked if we have our power. Wait, 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 wait. Guys, does that count? Technically, it made a full loop. Nah, guys, we got it. We got to actually, you know what I mean when I say make a full loop. Oh, guys, we're stuck. Oh, we're stuck. What happened here? All right, guys, on a real note, though, that was not a full loop. I believe that car might work if we just give it a little bit more power. It might actually work, guys. Okay, guys, so we got the three thrusters on this car. Got the long base wheel base again. Let's test this out and see. Ready, guys? Let's go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, guys, guys, we did it. We freaking did it. Let's go. Let's go. I don't even care if it turned upside down at the end. It went that way. It made a full 360 loop. Let's go, guys. My life is officially complete. Oh, that is awesome, guys. I don't know what to do now. What do I do now? I did not expect that to work. What am I supposed to do? Wait, I know. Wait, what if I make that car again? But this time, I put this a little bit lower. So that way, it doesn't flip upside down. And then it could just keep going. Well, guys, I fixed that bottom part right there. I got my second account sitting in a chair right there, ready to go. We're going to see if this works while somebody is sitting in the chair. And it looks like... Um, from my point of view, it doesn't even look like the chair is going to make it. So we'll have to see how that works. But without further ado, I'm going to hit this button here. And let's see. We're going to watch together what happens. Just as I thought. Yep, it's stuck. All right, we're going to push this back here. We're going to have to break maybe a couple of these off. So I don't know if adding those even did anything. But I really want to see a person go around on this thing. <laughs> That's going to be awesome. But let's push, let's push this guy back. Push him back to his starting position. And yeah, once again, we're both going to watch for the first time. See what happens here, you guys. You guys ready? All right, let's go. There, it went. Oh my goodness, guys. It went. Ha <laughs> ha, it's going again. Oh my goodness, guys. A double loop. A double loop and they're upside down. Guys, we did it. We freaking did it. We did a double loop. Oh my goodness, guys. All we had to do was put a person in the seat. Are you okay down there? Are you alive? I don't think he's alive. He's in the ground. Oh my goodness, guys. That was amazing. I actually didn't think we would be able to do two loops, let alone one loop. Oh my goodness, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button like I said earlier in the video. And if you want to see more amazing content like this, hit that subscribe button, turn post notifications on, and you will never miss an amazing new video like this. But anyways, I will see you all in the next one.